Every year, millions of people, make New Year's resolutions, hoping to spark, positive change. The recurring themes, each year include a more active, approach to health and fitness, improved finances, and learning new things, for personal, and professional development. Chances are, more than a couple, of the most common resolutions, which will look familiar to you. Exercise more. Lose weight. Get organized. Learn a new, skill or hobby. Live life to the fullest. Save more money, spend less money. Quit smoking. Spend more time, with family and friends. Travel more. But, the most, top 10, New Year's resolutions are. Number 1. Set a goal, that motivates you. To do this, you need to make sure, the goal you set, is important to you, and only you, and there is value, or benefit, for you in achieving the goal. These are the things, that will provide, reason, and willingness, to take action. This is also, known as, motivation. Number 2. Limit resolutions, to a manageable, amount. We only have, so much attention, we can dedicate, to self-improvement, having too many, resolutions, is a great way, not to achieve, any goals, we have set out, for ourselves. We, all want, to learn, 25 different languages, 15 new job skills, and, eliminate 5 bad habits, at a time, this cannot work out. Number 3. We must, be specific. When it comes, to setting resolutions, it's easy to set, bad goals that could, lead to poor performance. Fortunately, smart goal setting, which this framework, can help in crafting, a better goals. Specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, time sensitive. Number 4. Break up, the big goals, into smaller goals. A lot of us, tend to be over eager, when it comes to, resolutions. We have the best, of intentions and, may accidentally, take on a goal, that is too big to achieve. Well, it's always helpful, to divide, big goal into smaller, goals that are more, achievable. Number 5. Write down, your goals. It's very good, to have goals, and it is critical, to document them, in many way, because goals are easy, to forget, if we failed, to write them down. Number 6. Share your resolutions with others. If you want to take goal sharing to the next level, you could organize a mastermind group. A mastermind group is a collection of highly motivated people who share a common goal and are looking to encourage and help each other improve. Number 7. Automate where possible. The good news is that, now we all have technology, in our pocket, that can help us to follow, through our resolution, automation in the form, of reminder apps. Nowadays, there are a million different apps, and services, to help you follow through, on your resolutions. They're free tools, from Google to use, like. Google Calendar, you can set a recurring meeting, tied to your resolution, i.e. scheduling workout sessions at the gym. Google Now, personal assistant, that provides information as you need it. Reminders, on iOS set up timed alerts for tasks. Boomerang for Gmail, schedule reminder emails, to yourself. Number 8. Review your resolution regularly. It may seem a little crazy, to think about your resolution, every single day, but it is those smaller, incremental steps that, lead to massive changes, over the course of a single year. At a minimum, review should be monthly, and more frequent the better. Number 9. If you fall off the track, try to get back on quick. Rome was not built in a day. Setbacks can happen, but so long as they are handled correctly, they will not impact the big goal. 
The key is to avoid, a defeatist attitude at all costs, i.e. well I screwed up once, why should I even, try to do this anymore. Once a mistake is made, own it and, move on to the next thing, and a few, small mistakes shouldn't, spoil your resolution, for the year. Number 10. Mentally prepare for change. Naturally, your resolution may focus on areas that lack progress, but don't forget to savor the progress made, and find some small way to celebrate. Those happy feelings are useful. If possible, try to associate them, with an object or, word related to your accomplishment. The first breakthrough in change, is taking a personal inventory. Being that it's the end of one year, and the beginning of the next, it's perfect timing, to take stock in the past year's accomplishments. Think about the following. What did I set out to do in the past year? Where did I make progress? Where didn't I see progress? You will want to keep, update with your new resolution, so you can use that, positive association with last year's accomplishments, to remind you of those good feelings, when you are feeling challenged. Please, remember to support our channel, by subscribing, and as well dropping us, a comment. And if you like the video content, kindly like, and share it with friends.